You did freaking awesome. I'm proud of you. Thank you. You won the second veto. That was weird. <laughs> you earned it. <laughs> Great job, Michelle. Awesome. Congratulations, Michelle. That's good. So whether you decide not to use her or not, you're safe. And even if you did decide to use it on one of us, you can't go up. So. Best of all worlds. I hold the fate of the two nominees in my hands. It's very awesome to know that I have the power to save or uh, send Ronnie home. I mean, and Michelle, I'm not, I'm not above begging. I mean, what? I don't know what I can do. But I swear, I've been nothing but honest with you since all this. So see, all that I ask is, if you really do trust me, Jesse, Natalie, and Shima, and you want to be part of the vibe, then I know you would use it on me. We'll talk. Did hang out? Hang on? Yeah. Upstairs? Yeah. Let's go. How could this just happen? Everybody just went inside. I don't know. I think Michelle is very shady in this game. I think she's playing all sides. So for Michelle and Russell to be talking, it makes you wonder, hey, what what's really going on here? I mean, you're in a similar boat. Like, I don't have a, a, like a personal friend in this place where like, Kevin and Lydia are a team. Yeah. Jeff and Jordan are a team. Mm -hmm. Natalie and Jesse are a team. I don't have anyone as my yeah. team. Yeah. I have to win to stay here. And I think you're in the same yeah, boat. Yeah, I'm in, exactly in the same boat. I want to be on your team. <laughs> now that she has the power of veto, it's very important to figure out what Michelle's thinking and get on her side and uh, see if I can use this relationship down the road. But definitely, if, you, if you're down, I don't think anyone would know. I think it would be a scary tandem. It's a killer. <laughs> Look at them, they're just like, like they're always together, they're always going. Like, You're so sad, they're like, how is Michelle still there? <laughs> Come in! Let me know if you guys want to play chess or anything, we're just going to be chilling out here. Okay. Yeah. You know what's weird is like, they'll come in like, just to keep tabs on me to see like, what I'm doing. I'm like, I know you guys are like, threatened. Like, he's super threat because he, he's not as smart as me. You know what I mean? I gotta go to the bathroom first. Are you going to the bathroom in there? Let him talk, because they're going to talk regardless, you know? Okay. That's how I see it. She might not be saying anything. I not like it anything. She just won anything. Yeah. But she's, she's not winning. She's skating by on me and Jesse. Mm -hmm. Us not going upstairs could be a downfall for us. I think we should go up. All I'm saying is, regardless of whether we're there or not, they've already talked to me. Well, as long as you trust me now, that's all that matters. I mean, I did trust you. I was never going to put you out of the house. I wasn't going to nominate you. Well, just I even just... trust me as far as what I'm saying, like what yeah. I've said before and like how I stood up. No, you're a stand-up guy. <sighs> Michelle is starting to trust me. She believes in me. I think she is smart. She is an intelligent player, but I do have to make sure that Michelle does not use the veto, so I will be keeping a very close eye on her. But why the f are she sitting there? He's not that interesting, nor is she. When it comes to Michelle, nobody exactly knows what this girl is thinking. Seeing them in that room for so long together kind of made me wonder. I'm actually worried about the fact that they could use the power of veto in Shice Jesse week four. Ugh. What up? Mm -hmm. She's not voting for you, dude, just so you know. No, I understand. Um, your only hope is to possibly convince her. Try, dude. It's not gonna hurt you. Try. Offer her what anything you gotta do. 
I had tried compassionately and very politely stating to Michelle the obvious benefits of me staying. Now it was time to be a little more forceful. I know you don't want me in the house. And let me just say this, Kevin and Lydia, Oh, no allegiance to anyone. But Jesse, Natalie, and Shima, I'm 100% with them. Mm -hmm. So if I leave this house, I know who do you think they will blame for my eviction? I know. I know. And then the cheese stands alone. I hope you see, because you're very smart, strategically it actually significantly weakens you. And thinking logically about this game, you will be evicted if I leave that door, and you will not make it to the final two.